this for a long time. Brian, she was 16 with this deal. When are we supposed to be talking about the game? Hmm? Is this it? Is it going right now? Yeah, the... Oh, well, you cut off the beginning. Yeah, of course. I'm not that stupid. Actually, let me have it. Yeah, my drink. Rise above it, Arco. Rise above it. Rise above it. Rise. <laughs> what the hell? I'm turn down the volume a little bit. Six. Okay. Is that a word? The Og? Yeah. Sure, why not? No, but was it a word before this game? <laughs> Probably not. So, I guess we'll start with this. I bought this. It literally just popped up on Steam. It's been on, out on PC for a while. I forgot what it came out. But it came out on Steam pretty much the day I posted on Google Plus we must play this game. I bought it on impulse. All I all I read about the game was the the first sentence of the description was a one to four player uh, randomized story adventure game. So there's going to be a lot of reading. You know, not that much. Uh, well, we'll see. <laughs> and uh, we'll pass the control around. And... You played well, it already? You no, I did not play. I, I, later I read reviews and I wish I had it. I think it's going to be a really fun game. It'll take 15 minutes to play. And that's why I called you guys to come over all day. <laughs> uh, so, let's start. <clears throat> Do we need a narrator? Uh, we'll read our own parts. So we need to, um... Yeah. So, uh, there's, uh, four characters. Two males, two females. The blue, red is female, yellow is green, and it's males. I don't care who I get. Do you guys care? Also... Don't fuck with the audience of it, though. They want to hear your voice. They want yeah, to hear you clear. Fucking speak. I, I've listened to you speak. You know how I'm using Especially, my no, but I've done microphone voice? Well, well, when he's read things, though, he starts off... It's it's like in class, the kid that doesn't want to read, and then he just starts trailing off. <laughs> he's like, martial arts. Okay, well... <laughs> you um, learn martial arts? Back in the days. And you still fit in that shirt. Was back in the days. So. Oh no, no, that like. Well, I got that guy. What's your name? Uh, okay, um, just looking at. You. What's your favorite color? This is a terrible question. Black. That doesn't work. That's out. Look at me. <laughs> What's your favorite color? You're gonna be green. Uh. John, what you said black is not a color, it's the absence of color. Fuck yeah, but... <laughs> uh... What's your fa- uh, John, what's your second favorite color? Red. I said John. Right, Blue, yellow, or red? I don't know what my favorite color is, but I want to say blue right now. You're... Gonna be her then, and I guess I'll be yellow. Because I want you to be red. You want me to be red? What? I wanted to be okay. the chick. No, I want to be her. Oh, okay. No, I don't care. I'm just kidding. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> I'll be her. I don't care. No, no, you said blue. Fuck you. Yeah, that's fine. I don't I'll care. be red, and Arthur will be green. By the way, my name's James, and this is Slugbed Reviews. Plays a random fucking game I bought. With me is Arthel. Yeah. Oh, no, I thought... Oh, no. <laughs> Who will We're be playing uh, Mustachio, um, green guy, and John is also with us. What's up? And he's going to be playing blue chick. No, James, you should be green guy. Looks funny. <laughs> Fine, I'm green and you're red. Because she looks more like you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know there what's funny? Go. Actually, we <laughs> all look like our characters now. <laughs> Like, I mean, the ones we have the most in common with, anyways. Like, I'm, I'm as pale as her. <laughs> oh my god. I just need to grow my hair out. Okay, so, I'm oh, green, really. Arthel's red, and John is blue, and this is the Yog. 
on Earth. The Yog will be here in six weeks, and no one expects it. Not one of us. We just keep on living our lives week by week, unaware. Wait. It's a Yog. Alright, go ahead. The Yog, man! Don't worry about it. Wait, no one expects it. Exactly. Okay, so we don't know what a Yog is. Yeah. Okay, this is like the quiet year. Remember that? I remember the quiet year, but how is it linked to uh, the introduction is, um, you know, the, I forgot what the term was, but it was like, you know, uh, this great thing is going to come at the end of the game. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah. And we had to define it, but I think this is defined already. <clears throat> um, blue. So, that is John. Here you go. There's six weeks. Each turn is a week. Those are your stats up there. Wealth is zero, magic is five, charm five, mind five, finesse five. Oh, it's gonna be four. Five. And you choose something to do each week. Do? Yeah, forest, arena, alchemy tower, gardens, palace, tavern, hospitals, or the Well, slums. considering I'm a poor fuck. Okay, are you gonna pickpocket or fight crime? Like, rob people? Is that what. Rob or fight crime? I'm not a criminal, but I'm also, well, well she could be fighting crime, but she just didn't look like the type. Well, you can do something else then. Back out. No, I'm doing something oh, in the slums. Okay. Something in the slums is happening. <laughs> What's your character's name? You know what? No. No one expects her to. Look, now she looks like a beast that fights crime, right? <laughs> Spend the week outsmarting and beating up criminals. Gain one mind, one physique, and one right. one, day while, one day while wandering the slums, you notice that the stones used to line the road seem to have a certain pattern to them. You don't manage to figure out the mystery, but you still feel pretty smart for noticing the patterns of the tiles. Of course. Gain one mind. Wait, I didn't have one mind before? You gained one. But I didn't have one mind before, so I was a retard. There you yes. My turn. Or uh, did I have five? I think you had fun. Okay, never mind. So I wasn't right there. And it seems my stats equals yours. And I probably could go to the slums. So, so do we all start off with the same stats? It looks like it. Okay. We'll see with our fell. Um. <clears throat> Wait. So I eliminated the slums from you, or? I don't know. Let's see. Yes, you did. Uh -huh. Oh, right. so that's that's how this game works. Um. You know what? I am gonna go to the gardens. And that guy looks like someone who spends time in gardens. I'm <laughs> going to ooh, meditate or landscape. I, I want to see like this new animation now. Four years. <laughs> I'm gonna be. I'm gonna meditate. He, he seems like a spiritual fellow. You spend the week in deep meditation. You gain one magic and two mind. One day a beggar comes up to you asking for any spare change. Give him some coin minus one wealth or ignore him. Sir, if I had the money I would. Well fuck you. He walks away. What's the point of meditating and clutching at his stomach? Yeah, I'm ignoring him. I'm meditating really. No, hard. no, no, no. You, meditating, you're supposed to be like uh, Alright, go ahead. I mean <laughs> He walks away clutching at his stomach. The you next like, night, you notice him, and he looks very weak. You feel terrible. You lose one mind. You're an awful person. Yeah. <laughs> Here you go, or now. I feel like shit. Um. <laughs> Hector, don't act. Yeah. No, oh, he's so fake. You spend the week fighting brutes and the You're so right fake. Now. Come on, read it. Let's go feds and lose <laughs> That's what hurt the face. One finesse. During a match in the other way, where his weapon is locked from the gate to the grass. Yo, I almost died. Who's this? Ooh. Keep reading that. What? I'm a killer? No! He's doing his own. I actually like this. <laughs> Wow, take the black guy to court. 
Black, black girl. girl. Black girl. Black girl. Black girl. <laughs> black girl. <laughs> no. You. Oh, no. What am I doing? I, I defend do. myself. I need to be quiet. I'm getting to all the instructions. Oh, community service? I don't want to live in this racist town anymore. <laughs> They said the last time it came, the Yog devoured houses whole, stole lives, tore families and family members apart. But that was so very long ago. Yeah. <clears throat> it doesn't. If I click it, I can back out, right? I think so, yeah. Okay. How long? Um. Is my first step. Hmm. Kinda looks like a nun. Or a big wife. Yeah. You spend the week diagnosing and tending to the sick. You gain two mind and earn one well. One day you hear spooky sounds echoing through the hospital. Soon afterwards a glowing blue ghost flows down from the ceiling. She seems to be wandering the halls aimlessly, howling out horrible noises. She doesn't appear to realize that she is freaking everyone out. You decide to do something about it. Oh. Uh, your magic's five and your charm's five. I'm assuming that's what we're talking about. You know what? I don't, I don't want my person to be all... It's two beasts, you know what I mean? I'm already beating up crimes. I, I mean, criminals <laughs> beating up crimes. <laughs> Take that, that stealing! Be... <laughs> you approach the spirit and try to explain to her the effect she is having on the sick. You're not convincing enough to be able to persuade her to stop her haunting. Eventually everyone gets used to her and learns to live with the creepy ghost. Your mental resolve hardens. You gain one mind. I'm gonna try the forest. I, I belong there as well. I am one with nature. Well, fuck. I'm one with nature, but fuck wood and animals. Wait, <laughs> wait, 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 wait. It could be like the Native American type, you know what I mean? You're gonna use it to its full potential. Oh, and... uh, let's what see. My mind's like six, jack. my charm's five, my magic six. Lumberjack. Uh. Yeah, I probably need. This will probably get me wood chopping. Uh, not wood. Uh, wealth chopping wood. Huh? Well, hunting as well. You could potentially. True. Because it it could either uh, give you physique for eating it, or it can give you wealth from selling furs. Or something. Oh, okay. or maybe I think hunt would get me f uh finesse and chop the wood would be physique. I'm gonna chop wood. You spend the week cutting down trees for the village. You gain two physique and earn yourself one wealth. One day you come across a group of people in the woods. Oh, how nice. From the expressions on their faces, they appear to be lost. What? Why would I rob them? Rob them, James. I would murder them. Rob them. Not rob them. Rob them? I mean, murder them? <laughs> what, what? I thought you were I one have with an nature. Axe. Rob so, them. So, so you're that I'm serial killer. I'm not robbing them. You're that serial Why? killer who like cuts himself afterwards every time. Rob them in the forest. <laughs> Nobody you're meditating. Know. Fuck you, I'm not giving you change. And Nobody then you kill the know. next person. Nobody will know, they're already lost. <laughs> I will help them. That I have done harm with that beggar. Now I shall redeem myself. You confront the group and try to help them find their way back to town. With ease, you lead everyone back to town. Extremely grateful, the group gives you a small token of their appreciation. You gain two wealth. That's you better give next nice. time if someone asks you. Fuck yeah, I am. <laughs> <laughs> I was nipped. Yeah, yes. Yeah. Sorry, I got confused right there. <laughs> yeah, make the black girl serve. Mm. Or drink. Wow. Either way, you make it sound bad. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, queen. Oh, this guy is lame. He's looking at everything. <laughs> That's fine. No. A mission really work. Yep. Oh, of course, the black person. Yeah. Doing paperwork, baby. 
What do you mean? That's probably a good job. Oh, I do well. I got paid. It's for the well, palace, man. One Come mine. On. Let's go. Lead against the wall. I'm about to get beat. <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh, yes. Oh, man. Oh, my God. I'm about to find this is a secret partner. Yeah. Shoot it, bro. Oh, God. Whoa. What? Wine uh, cellar. Get drunk tonight. Whoa, that that was a lot bigger. Than oh that. man! Oh, oh my god! Oh my god! Nobody shows up. Oh god, oh, man! Your fortitude. Oh, what? I'm a hard drinker, it was baby. Honest in a heartbeat. Nobody so wants the to... stories go. The earth shook. The air went still. Nobody wants to drink with the black girl. Nobody wants to drink with the black girl. I would. You didn't invite me. You didn't know me. I'm assuming. I, I was in the woods helping. You know. I definitely would have done. That's all I'm saying. Look, I'm just saying. What's the, the tavern? black girl asked me to go drink it. What's the tavern? It's a bar. Oh, I'm an idiot. Yeah. <laughs> kind of. <laughs> well, you know what? I gotta make money somehow. Sure. I've been fighting crime and. It's not gonna give me the same option when I click it, though. Is it? Uh, yeah, that's it. Yeah. Picture is different. Oh, because <laughs> I'm in it. Yeah, but I like that little detail, you know? There are some games that don't do that. No, it is different. Oh, Just different. would you like to learn to juggle? He asks excitedly. I'll teach you everything I know for a small sum. Oh, he's nasty. Oh, well. He's a freak. That's not bad. It's, a freak junk. it's not bad, but I'm He's trying to make money today. That's bad. Money. Okay. He's a freak dude. Hmm. Says the jester. He walks away disappointed. I know he was trying to, he was trying to make moves just now. Wait, no, he was trying to charge me. So there's no way he was trying. He, he was sincere. He, he wouldn't charge me. Yeah. Right? That evening on the way home, you find a golden coin on the ground. What luck! Making money. <laughs> wow. Wait, okay. Thank um, you. Well, I have another way to make money, and that's bet on fighting. You spend the week placing bets on your favorite fighters. You gain two wealth! One day, while wandering the halls, one of the arena's fighters approaches you. Excuse me, sir. I need a spying partner, he says. Are you down for a fight or two? Except his challenger refer to him to the burly guy next to you. You know what? I got a pretty good physique, I think. So I'm gonna accept the fight. Let's do this! Oh god. It's Corey and co-host. <laughs> That's a good reference. Yeah. <laughs> he screams. I wish you would get back involved with the Empire Science I check. The uh, co-host not gonna be involved with um... So far I haven't heard anything about it. Oh, uh, maybe they're trying to set everything up. It seems, um... Martin, that's his real name. Yeah. The, the he, other, yeah, he's definitely in it. Yeah, he, but he might be doing it for like not that much money, you know. Yeah. Um, he takes a swing at your head. Oh shit! You get punched square in the face. <laughs> the next thing you know, you're in the arenas and oh, oh, all that science for no reason. <laughs> it appears that punch gave you what? Yeah, I could never end this. <laughs> okay, he's he was this. Oh, he a was a sorceress. A headache that never ends. Ah, oh. headache that never ends. Symptoms include having a mild headache for ah uh, for the rest of your life you have a headache. Gosh. Oh, you lose one mind. Huh? Holy crap! Look at his physique. I didn't even. Oh shit! Yeah. I'm the burly man. So fighting. She's You're a beast. I'm the burly guy. You're a busty woman. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. <laughs> He's sick of getting yeah, pushed around. Week performing petty theft. Gain one wealth and two fit. That's creepy. Uh, yup. I'm Robin Hood here. Yeah, okay. I'm Robin Hood.
Nice. What? What? Damn! <laughs> and then the world was howling for fury, chaos reigning, the sound of all we know being pulled in half. What? John, your turn. Oh. Um. Also, our thumb. Gotta keep people. You're, you don't have to read it necessarily, but you have to at least do what you're doing the first time. We're still not going to know what was going on. But you know, that also kind of falls on us. We should have reacted to it. I was reacting. Yeah! What? No, no, but I'm saying. <laughs> like, the crowd in the background. <laughs> okay. Well, I got my monies. I'm okay. going back to the slums. I'm probably going to get my ass kicked this time. You spend the week outsmarting and beating up criminals. You gain one mind physique and finesse. One night a woman walks up to you. Excuse me, miss. Feeling a little lonely tonight, she asks? That's nice. true. Yeah. For only a small amount of coin. No. This is a good night for no. um, gay couples. But. but <laughs> <laughs> Alright. People have no idea what you're talking about. But, anyways. Yeah, I don't fucking care. <laughs> um, she needs to feed her kids. This is no, but this is just BS. Like I thought, this this is not a gay couple. This is she's a prostitute. No, yeah. no. She needs to feed her kids. Oh, too well. Fuck no. No, I. She's expensive. Right? She's they, a whore, dude. She's pretty though. Y'all lost. It's not a loss. If she's pretty, she doesn't even know. I'm already working, right? I don't need. This. Um, you know what? I have five wealth. Um, I say I will attend a ball. I think I shall enjoy my wealth. I'm clearly wealthy enough to spend time with the king. You spend the week attendance, fancy gatherings. You gain two charm and one finesse. One day you accidentally bumped into a duke. Watch where you're going, filthy peasant. He shoves you out of the way with his hand and continues walking. Passive aggressive response. Active aggressive response. Active. Wait, have you been? You teach that bastard. Yeah, because I was gonna say. You got pushed you, in your head. Yeah, you were ready to go fight earlier, so I hope you haven't been humbled by that experience. No, you got pushed in your head earlier. You, you can't think right, so you do it active aggression. I have a headache, man. I know you have. You're, you're not. You're not thinking. Does this no, look but... like a? He's ginger. He's not a violent fellow. No, I you was were just ready to that fight. Guy. You were ready to fight. But then this is another thing. You have a headache. You're not thinking straight. You would act like yeah. when I'm when I have a headache, I'm ready to fight. Active. No, no, you gotta do what you you feel like doing it. But I'm just saying, I when I don't want to talk. Will people talk to me when I'm having? The only reason active. No, no. The only reason I'm gonna let this up to vote because active, I'm assuming, is physique, and passive, I'm assuming, is charm, which is both equal. Active. You shove him back. He stumbles slightly. That was kind of. <laughs> You lost one charm. <laughs> I knew it was a terrible idea. That's why we said you're not thinking straight. <laughs> well, I thought maybe the king would be like, yeah, that guy's a dick. Good job. <laughs> Rue a What? Experimenting scientist over here. Scholar. Yep, gain two magic. Do this. Help. I shouldn't go over there. Oh, God. Mustard? No, that's time to run. I'm black. I'm gonna stay around for trouble. Uh, let's see, your physique is a light and your magic is a I am a burly young woman, so. But my magic is. Young? I am young. I'm trying to say I'm not attractive. I mean, no, you seem no, no, just at all older when they're not attractive. <laughs> <laughs> and it moves with a part of an array of magic spells because I'm a beast. I'm a charming young When it arrives this time, how will we fare? Will we once more rebuild, move on, be strong, or have we forgotten? I think this Yogg thing is going to be a big kind of deal, guys. I'll take care of it. It's week five already, wow. Well, I can't ignore these patients that I help them with. While you spend the week diagnosing and tending to the sick, you gain two mind and earn one wealth. One day while in the maternity ward, you notice a woman about to give birth. The baby she births is no ordinary baby, however. Its skin is pitch black and shiny, 
and its eyes glow like an orange flame. Holy shit. Devil baby. It wrestles itself from the doctor's hands. It's wrestling art. It's fighting through. Try. It tries to fly away. <laughs> Stop that demon, yells the doctor. Uh, you have no strength. I have more strength than I have magic, though. Yeah. I feel like it's gonna rip your hands apart. You put yourself between the demon and the exit. The baby demon barrels past you and out the door, flying off into the night sky. Oh, it didn't take away anything or do anything. That's the yacht, oh, man. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> the thing's gonna grow up, come back, and kiss, kick my ass for not letting it go. What is it? The, uh... What is that? Antichrist. <laughs> Antichrist has come. I will meditate. You spend the week in deep meditation. You gain more magic into your mind. Walking past the pond one day, you see a fat little frog sitting on a lily pad. Please, sir, the frog begs. I am not a frog at all, but an enchanted prince. Stab him. Oh, here's your gay if moment, James. If you could James. see your way to kissing me, it would here's break your gay moment, James. Into normal. Kiss the frog or catch the frog. Kiss him. Kiss him, bro. This is your moment. It's kind of bestiality, but all right. No, he's not a down frog. And kiss he's the an frog. enchanted prince. Yeah, okay. You, say you feel a curious stirring, like a curse trying to break. You're gonna turn to I'm just kidding. <laughs> Unfortunately, you don't seem to be magical enough to get Ah, uh, you impotent The frog son thanks of you for your effort and hops off saddle. You wake up the next morning with a bad kiss of the woods. Herpes! <laughs> you lose one charm. Herpes! Jesus, <laughs> herpes! You got herpes. Uh, yeah. He has herpes and a headache forever. <laughs> We're gonna go to the tavern. Woo. You know, I like to work. That's what I do. So I'm a bartend. Spend the week serving drinks. Yep, serving drinks, beast. What? Tips In money. What? Oh, dirt. Nice. I suppose I will enter. Your finesse is pretty good. What? Respectable game. Second, second nice. place. Second is not first. Hey. Wait, what's that Ricky Bobby quote? If you ain't first, you're last. Sick. <laughs> Too well? What? And gain a confidence boost. See? Why Why can't you be more confident? Yeah, it's almost here. Please. Almost. Almost. <laughs> almost isn't the first. I feel like the y'all is the fall. The y'all is the fall. You spend the week hunting defenseless critters. You gain two finesse and sell the pelts for one rub. I was right. One day you stumble upon a triad. What is a triad? Picking flowers in a field. Upon noticing you, she runs up to you excitedly. Excuse me, miss. Would you care to dance? She asks. I've been wanting to dance for so long, but nobody else has been around to dance. She sighs. Um, she sounds crazy, but fuck it. <laughs> she giggles and takes you by the hand. She starts humming out a song, and the two of you dance together in the middle of the forest. The two of you have perfect chemistry. All of your movements are perfectly in sync. You dance with her well into the night. Afterwards, she thanks you for the lovely evening with a kiss on the cheek. You feel energy radiate through your body. You gain three charm. Seriously, it's a really good thing so for her. <laughs> I have a lot of beard moments here. I have a headache that never ends, lip warts. That was the same thing that happened. That was the same exact thing that happened in that period. Dancing, caught up in the moment. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But I think I well flips, <laughs> drink myself to death. You spend the entire week getting wasted. Chocolate wasted. You gain two charm and one physique. One day a bard pulls out his lute in the bar and starts playing a tune. Unfortunately, his singing is horrible and is ruining the tavern's atmosphere. You decide to do something about it. Convince him to leave, 
Challenge him to a loot duel. A loot duel. Yeah, fuck it. You borrow the bar owner's loot and challenge the bot to a musical duel. You play out a beautifully complex combination of Eregios. The tavern wars with applause. Something good happening? The bard tries his best to replicate your piece, but ends up dropping his loot, snapping it in half. Okay. Uh -huh. He bows his head shamefully in defeat and walks out of the tavern. You gain one finesse and one charm. Beast. Beast mode. I'm going back to the arena. I like to fight. Okay. Spend a week fighting brutes in the arena. Dang. I'm amazing. Strong. Still won't run. What? Stri steroids? They're using steroids. I <laughs> knew it. She cries. No, I'm reporting your ass. I report her. Yep, I reported your ass. Nobody's allowed to use steroids. Damn. The storm arrives in the night. By the morning, it still rages. For three full days, the tempest put us through a grinder, drown us, crushes us, ruins us. But then it ends. We see the graveyard our home has become. Our home. Does anything yet live? Is it? Are we past saving? Damn. Okay. Choose your role. You take it upon yourself to be the leader of the survivors. You try to delegate tasks, but can't get many to listen. You try to give congratulations to hard workers, but your words come across as insincere. You help the rebuilding effort a little bit. Ah, <clears throat> uh, Town drunk. You did spend a week drinking. A week. Ah. <clears throat> uh, I'm gonna beat it a little bit. You've really fallen off from the beginning. <laughs> you just got broken down. <laughs> <laughs> ah shit! The <laughs> down drunk. That's definitely what yeah. You're I kind of <laughs> my skills are kind of bad. And you got all messed up before the yeah. end came. <laughs> you scavenge together as much alcohol. You can redeem you yourself can later on, I'm sure. And drink excessively. You gain two physique and one charm. Get stronger. Who said you couldn't drink your problems away? Your choice now. You know what? I'm going to be the leader. Let's do this. You can't. Uh, yeah, okay. That'd be amazing. Well, alright, I'm gonna be a builder. I have a nice physique. By hand! Fuck. Impressing. A beast. Significantly. And so we set about our task once more living our lives, this time in a way we might never have expected. Or even wanted, but in the end, we, we were, were defeated. defeated. Those of us left struggled to put our home to rights, but the effort was futile, doomed. The city bled survivors, eventually becoming a husk, a dead thing. And perhaps the Yogg was only partly to blame. Fuck this game. <laughs> wait, wait, there's more. <laughs> In the ruins of the village, you try to set up some form of infirmary to help cull the rampant diseases running muck. I know how to... <laughs> you try to find helpers, but it appears anyone able enough has either fled the city or died. Either way, you try your best to cure the scores of plagues killing people all over the world. Unfortunately, all your contact with various disease takes its toll. You die without saving anyone. Uh, with the I'm, town in ruins. With the towns in ruins, you decide to flee and go through the woods to seek a new home. This venture is cut short, however, as you are mauled to death by a mysterious beast. <laughs> 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 Yo, that is awesome. That is awesome. It's a, I think it's 
that is awesome. <laughs> Our good spirit serves you guys well after the y'all. We started on the ground potion brewing facility. <laughs> <laughs> wow. What? <laughs> this is terrible. <laughs> you get people almost addicted to your various and exchange them for favors and services. <laughs> you do well for yourself within the broken walls of your former village. The fact that many people are dying from the potion overdose phases you little <laughs> while breaking bad much. <laughs> um, and that was the yog. You know where I think I messed up? Yeah. When I didn't choose doctor. Yeah. I think if I would've chose Doctor, that would've changed the whole thing. Yeah. Um... You guys wanna play one more? Sure. But you Just know, to see how different it can be? Yeah. This is the thing. I was thinking about choosing Doctor, but then I was like... That's my my character was the- but my character was most selfless, so I thought that maybe people would have known that, but apparently not. They were like, we don't do something, don't tell us what to do. 